Hello YouTube, this is Mayan J and the purpose of this video today is to show you how to install the recovery image on the GooPhone i5. Uh, first I want to show you that I have updated the ROM on this phone. It came from a, uh, it's a Chinese ROM that I have been also modifying. Uh, the great thing about this ROM is that it fixes the notification center from the stock ROM that comes with the phone from factory and it also gives you the uh, the toggles, uh, the quick settings on top of the notification bar and of course it looks more like the iPhone 5 okay um, also it gives you a smoother UI okay as you can probably see it's much uh, faster than the stock UI of course you're gonna have some uh, some apps that you don't actually don't need because uh, some of the apps that comes with the phone are in Chinese and this is uh, basically the preview also of the ROM that I'm starting to modify. Okay, and it comes with a Play Store, as you can see. Alright, the phone is, I would say, is about 35% much faster than with the previous ROM. And of course, I will install as many English apps as possible. On the contacts, there was a bug uh, where it didn't allow you to, it was really laggy. And as you can see now, it's really um, easy to scroll throughout the settings application is really fast um, once again you know I'm working uh, to improve this phone so uh, I'm going to show you now how to install the recovery image it's a really nice and um, unusual image um, also came from the Chinese and of course I'm going to show you how to do that uh, in this video okay the first thing you must do is you must download the uh, uh, from the link below you must download the uh, GooPhone i5 recovery image and once you download it you're going to extract it onto your desktop okay and as you can see it's going to show a folder just like this and you're going to see two files okay these two files are going to go in the phone so you're going to connect the phone to your computer okay now the next thing you're going to do is you're going to turn on USB storage and as you can see even USB storage is different uh, from the previous ROM that came stock with this phone as you can tell already it's not the same okay so we're going to turn on USB storage turn on okay alright once that happens you're going to uh, figure out which uh, it has two partitions you have to figure out which one is the one that has the it's actually the SD card which is just one because it has uh, the uh, the 10 gigabytes of free space out of the 14.6 so we're gonna place them on the G one okay now you gotta figure out which one is gonna be on your computer so now what we're gonna do is we're gonna open the folder and we're gonna send this uh, to the phone so you're gonna hit send to okay we're gonna select G okay the next one we're gonna send is the recovery image we're gonna hit send to we're gonna send it to the SD card okay once that happens now you can close this and you can turn off the USB storage okay once you turn USB storage now you're gonna go to the main page okay now what you're gonna do here is you're gonna uh, make sure that you have uh, either um, Astro file manager or some type of file manager that you can use okay and now you're gonna go to my files then uh, you're gonna go to files again and here is when you're gonna see it okay now you're gonna install for uh, first the uh, m 44 toolbox okay once you install it now you're gonna open it you're gonna allow super user okay um, this is gonna be a no and then you're gonna select recovery update okay once you do that it's gonna be the one on the very top that says recovery that image 
and then you're gonna it's gonna say are you sure you want to flash the recovery you're gonna select OK and now it's gonna say it's gonna ask you whether you want to reboot into recovery mode just so we can test this I'm gonna select OK and here it is here is the uh, recovery image if you go to the bottom here this is so you can uh, restart the phone reboot it this is so you can power off the phone okay uh, and of course it has many options so you can clear uh, cache and the way you do this is basically you select it and then you slide it and that will actually do that a specific command uh, same with clearing data as you can see from the top you clear data by you select it and then you slide it that will clear the data okay and then to install the ROM okay to install the ROM you're going to select the one on the very top from the main menu. Okay, you're going to select this one, and here you're just going to select the ROM, and then you choose the ROM that you want to flash, and then you slide to, to you, you slide it to the right, and it's going to actually install the ROM. Okay, this is how it works. But of course, I will be doing a tutorial on how to do that once the ROM that I'm modifying is ready. So stay tuned. Please subscribe. Thanks for watching and please comment below. Let me know if you have any questions.